Ladies and gentlemen, so that was Imagine by John Lennon and the song was about how he would imagine the world to be. And now we would want to explain to you and introduce you 2030 SDSN Youth New Initiative. With this project, we aim to use arts and culture as a tool for raising awareness about the SDGs and inspiring their implementation. So you would ask, why arts? Well, through history, artists have been witnesses, reporters, innovators, change makers, inspirers of a society development. Arts have also that power to envision new ideas and move us to follow the creative paths to develop them. You know, Leon Tolstoy once said, art is a human activity that has for its purpose the transmission to others of the highest and best feelings to which men have risen. So let's go to the first part of the sentence. Art is human. And as the most truthful expression of one's emotions, concerns, desires, ideals, art portrays her essence and humanizes us. Humankind cannot be understood without such cultural expressions that have served 
as testimonies of the greatest achievements, tragedies, and dreams of generations. Arts are communication, transmission of ideas. Unlike any other language, art is universal. Thus, it is the best tool to inspire people worldwide, not only through rational understanding, but also through emotions. With arts, we are not only able to raise awareness, but also to move minds and souls. With arts, we do not only inform, but we inspire. So let's go back to that quote. So we have that art is a human activity that transmits to others, and let's go to the final part, the highest and the best feelings to which men have risen. Now, you've been here for a long time, so what are those best and highest feelings and ideals that we are rising to right now to 2030? Any idea? What about there? What is it? The Sustainable Development Goals, what about that? Those are the ideals that we want to reach in 2030. And that's what in our initiative is about. So it's translated to a present time. These SDGs represent those higher values to which all humankind aspires. We need then to join forces to ensure the implementation of these SDGs, making sure that everyone is included in the process, leaving no one behind. Creativity and innovation are necessary to face the challenges that sustainability poses. Artists' new and unconventional solutions and ideas are a fundamental asset on this path. Therefore, combining arts and sustainable development, cultural and technological innovation, we can progress firmly to a new kind of global development. Economic growth, social inclusion, environmental preservation cannot be understood without the involvement of arts and artists. 2030 will work in this direction, creating a global platform of artists committed to do the SDGs implementation that through their work will build bridges of understanding, emphasizing what brings us all at, together as a global community. So what are we going to do exactly in 2030? Well, we are going to put in contact artists with scientists, politicians, engineers, academics, so they will work together as one. And culture will become then an active and core part of sustainable development, not an isolated field. And we will present these works at conferences around the world and in events in collaboration with our regional networks in order to make this artist's voice heard, having an impact in the conversations for sustainable development. So if you are an engineer or a doctor or even a politician, how can you contribute to 2030? Well, aside from being a singer, uh, I, have, I have also a background in economics, accounting, and I'm currently a student at CIPA Columbia, and Isabel here, she's also a um, law studies student. Um, so we know that these worlds are interrelated and they can and shall interact in order to achieve our global purposes. So, first of all, if you're an artist, join 2030. This is the great opportunity to channel your creativity towards something that is going to change not only your present, but your future. So if you're an engineer, a doctor in economics, etc., well, and you can become a 2030 patron also. So you can support an initiative that again will influence the lives of present and future generations through cultural expressions. Finally, if you have an organization that is already working in the promotion and implementation of the SDGs, either at a local or at an international level, a partnership with SDSN Youth on the 2030 initiative will help you access a new global audience. All right, so now I want you all to imagine about how world would it be in 2030 when we achieve the sustainable development goals. It must be wonderful, and that's why we're gonna perform What a Wonderful World by Neil Armstrong. I see trees of green too. I see them bloom for me and you, and I think to myself, 
What a wonderful world mm-hmm. I see skies of blue And clouds of white The bright blessed day The dark separate night And I think to myself What a wonderful world The colors of the rainbow So pretty in the sky Are also on the faces Of people going by I see friends chicken hands Saying hi What a wonderful world Thank you.